and we are broadcasting live from Supla Metro. It's World AIDS Day today. One looks at Supla. If you look at the HIV AIDS drugs, I think a third of the products used in Africa, mm. those are Supla products. We've been driving the concept of testing. So we believe if you've got 7 million people living on HIV, with HIV, mm-hmm. only half of those on treatment, 3.6, 3.4 million. Therefore, there's another 50% that are currently out there that could easily transmit their disease to somebody else. Yeah. If you identify the individuals that should be on treatment and everybody goes on to treatment, we can suppress that viral load. Suppress it so low that if you were to sleep with someone who's not infected, you would not transmit the disease. In those early days, medicine was costing as much as 170,000 rand a year. Now, that medicine, through the work of CIPLA, has been brought down to about just over 130 rands a month. Uh, But let's talk about the CIPLA Foundation. What we know about early childhood development, if a child goes through an ECD campus, they are more likely to stay five years longer in school. Not only that, they're probably more likely to earn 25% more in a salary when they grow up. So the ECD campuses at the moment, we've got over 450 children in them. We're a pharmaceutical company, but we're putting together a solution that the government can take on large scale.